You're probably wondering where we're at. We're actually going on a road trip. This is a bucket list of mine. So we're heading over to Germany to go check out the Nürburgring in the M140i. We're kind of crunched for time, yeah. Uh, our Euro Tunnel train is at 2.20, I think, and we expect to get there for like 1.50, so there's a possibility that we might miss it. That right there is a full tank. That is crazy, man. Bro, hello, say hello. Are you ready for the road uh, trip? Yes, I am. Uh, the M140i is ready. It's a bit, it's a bit dirty, but uh, we'll have to make do. I didn't have time to clean it, but uh, yeah. Let's head over uh, to Folkestone and get the Eurotunnel. Yes, sir. There's actually a fox. There's actually a fox. There's a fox. Maybe I should move my hot chocolate. I think he's a bit hungry. It's a bloody fox. What, what do we do with the fox? But anyways, long story short, we've literally missed the train. We was going to make it, by the way, but me being me, I thought this D5 thing means going into platform five. That's not the case. Bro, this fox is still here. It's kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. So I turned into platform five. It took me all the way around to the exit. And if you guys have been to the Euro Tunnel before, you guys know this thing is amazing. If you get lost, you get lost. We are now waiting for the next train, which is like an hour later. And uh, yeah, there's nothing much we can do right now, to be fair. Got some hot chocolate, but the car's looking fat, you know. All the mods that we've put on, Looks so sick. Yeah, the car is quite filthy, but it's looking sick. I'm not gonna lie, I've made a new friend. He's just waiting there for my crisps. Look at him crunching away. I might actually go get another crisp packet and just feed it to the fox. Oh! I think it's nearly time we're boarding. We've been waiting here for like about an hour now. My brother's knocked out like he's in a Rolls Royce. So if I didn't tell you, we're actually gonna cross through France, then Belgium, then we're gonna get to Germany. I'm actually looking forward to this because I've never actually driven myself on like a road trip across Europe. And this would not have been possible without Revolut. Revolut is a financial super app that lets you save, spend and invest your money and the Revolut app lets you stay in full control of your money and the app is so easy to use. As I am traveling abroad, one of the main features that stand out to me with Revolut is that you get no hidden charges and you get excellent exchange rates. So that is a must when I'm on a road trip, especially out of England. I always go on about how this is the best card I've ever owned and I still stick with that statement. Just take a look at this. This is the metal card and you can personalize it by adding a text or a little image onto the card to make it fully unique to you. Other key features that stand out to me are as I am on a road trip and if I happen to lose this card I can freeze and unfreeze this card instantly using the app and most importantly I can get instant payment notifications when I'm spending so this is key because if I'm abroad and I'm spending my money on fuel food I want to keep an eye on my spenders in general anyways so this is a very key feature to have. Revolut is going to be a key feature on this road trip and it's going to be the only card I'm going to be using and uh, if you guys want to make the most of the benefits that Revolut offer then go check them out and use my link to download Revolut and get yourself a £20 welcome bonus when you sign up. Where did I go wrong last time? I took the wrong like ramp down didn't I? But you're supposed to be my co-pilot, man. I'm not meant to know what this place is. Oh. But this is narrow, you know. Look at that. I'm going to curb my wheel. Definitely. We have successfully boarded the Eurotunnel train. About time. But this is about 30, 20, 25 minutes, 35 minutes. What? This journey. I don't know.
Just stopped off for breakfast at this service station by the motorway. Um, yeah, it's pretty hungry, pretty tired as well. My brother is still KO, as you can see. Still KO, yeah, we stopped off here. Um, yeah, we've still got about three hours to get to the Nürburgring. And uh, yeah, man, I'm actually tired. Like the whole of last night I didn't sleep. I only slept for about 20 minutes on the Euro tunnel. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna keep driving. I think I have to keep driving anyways. And um, yeah, hopefully I can get there in one piece. Germany, yeah, and we are on the autobahn, meaning the speed limit is unrestricted. So I'm gonna put it into sports, and uh, bro, you better strap on, you ready? Yeah. Very fast, what the hell? Another run, yeah. Let's see uh, how that goes. to give it yeah Germany has some sick views and some sick driving roads we're literally getting close to the Nürburgring yeah and the driving roads down here is so sick and especially the view as well uh, I'm not nice. yeah I'm not the one to usually just stop and like look at the views but I think I had to at Germany is a very nice country yeah how you feeling feeling good man but the problem is that this weather's too goddamn hot <laughs> So we just picked up our green hell card to actually go and drive on the Nürburgring. We're gonna go do a lap on, on the on the track and uh, see how it is, man. I've never done this before, so I'm kind of excited. And uh, yeah, let's see uh, what goes down. Hopefully we don't get into any trouble. Bro, this feels weird. Whoa, I don't like that. I don't oh. like that. I did not like that. That was a bit weird. I did not like that at all. Bro, that felt weird, didn't it? Bro, it, it just went like down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, the camera's moving all over the place. Yeah. This feels weird. Oh my gosh. I think I've broken my tripod. Oh, oh flip. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, oh my 
We're just going down and down. Bro, you know how fast we're actually going? Flip, man. <laughs> Are you right? The camera. Flipping out all over the place. I think this thing's broken. Oh, oh no, it's going up. It's going up now. It's going up. It's flipping going up, bro. It's literally going. Oh, that feels weird. Oh. I feel like you're going on a roller coaster. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my oh. days. We got, we, got, we got bear cars coming behind us. Do we? Yep. Sure. Yeah. Oh, okay, I see one. Gosh. What is actually the going bike. on? I'm scared. Bro, I, I, you know I'm sweating, right? I'm scared. Don't be scared. Not the Mazda. Not the Mazda. It's not worth the Mazda. Yeah, to calm down. To calm down then. Mazda wanted some. Shut up. Bro, do you, do you feel sick? I do. Do you want to go next to your name? Hell no. That was our first ever time on the Nürburgring. Oh my days, what an experience. Now we're gonna head back to the hotel and actually get some rest because I've hardly had any sleep and I'm literally so exhausted right now. Um, I mean, the car looks pretty exhausted as well, to be fair. But my brother, yeah, look at him. What a day it's been. I'm absolutely shattered, yeah. We've literally made it down to the hotel. This hotel is quite quirky. It's proper weird. Like, you probably can't see from here, but it is so weird. Uh, I'll show you the little video I took from my phone. Uh, we're back at belgium now and uh yeah man i hope you guys enjoy this little vlog europe trip and uh you know i got the opportunity to do it and uh yeah we've done it i want to do this again but hit even more cities around europe and uh yeah man let me know if you do enjoy these uh vlog style videos and um yeah appreciate you guys watching he slumped there as well and uh yeah i'll see you in the next video
車で来てるはん